a Sydney in Australia. Qui funziona la Mod Oz, cioè la moderna cucina australiana che raccoglie influenze di tutto il mondo, dall'Asia e dal Mediterraneo, usando prodotti locali, magnifici eh, molluschi, pesci, crostacei che si trovano su, in questi mari. Martin Ben, lo chef del ristorante Sepia, è inglese e già a 12 anni sognava di fare il cuoco. È arrivato a Sydney qui in Australia a 21 anni ed è oggi con il suo ristorante Seppia uno degli esponenti più rappresentativi di questo movimento della nuova cucina australiana. L'abbiamo intervistato nel suo ristorante. Perché Seppia? È un italiano, sì, ma la parola Seppia ha molti meanings. Firstly, uh, the, the color, sepia, in, in photography is uh, the shades of, uh, a shade of black and white. Yeah. So the tones of the restaurant, the colors of the restaurant are in that tone. Um, also, the meaning in Italian and in Greek is uh, for cuttlefish, yeah. for the squid, right? So um, one of my favorite ingredients is 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 this uh this fish so that was another um reason and the, and the last reason is my business partner is greek mm. so when we told him that the idea for the restaurant was really called sepia they were overjoyed ah. of the name so yeah lo chef martin ben ha preparato per il nostro libro un sepia tiramisu nel quale ci sono i savoiardi ma briciole di cacao un dolce spugnoso al caffè e naturalmente qualche tocco personale come la salsa al caramello salato. Ecco, ci racconta che come ha conosciuto questo. So, my my idea of tiramisu is that, you know, I I've I've seen it wherever you go in the world, any Italian restaurant you go in the world, you step into the first thing you see on the menu will be tiramisu. It's the most popular dessert. You know, some places do it very very well and some places do it very badly, I'm sure, you know. But, um, Uh, my idea of tiramisu is, um, well I know that the idea came from Venice where they, they wanted a, a dessert that was, um, I think it means something like um, wake up or, yeah, yeah. Uh, to, to keep you awake. Now there's a couple of stories and maybe I shouldn't go into those but I know that it was used to keep people awake uh, and, and my idea is really just a mascarpone cream, savrodi biscuits, coffee. Ricorda dove mangiò il suo primo tiramisu? Oh, I think the first time I ate tiramisu was in a restaurant uh, Giorgio Locatelli in London. Oh, okay. I think he did a version of uh, of uh, tiramisu um, and it was it was very good. It's very good. It's a delicious dessert, absolutely.